Chris from Aspect Maintenance, an uh, electrical company based in centre London. Today we're just going to have a sort of quick look at a, a four inch extractor fan where you'd find in a, any domestic bathroom. Um, what we've chosen is this brand here, just so just to see. Here you can see it just lets you know the, the switched live, the neutral and the permanent live. The, uh, that, that lets you know that this has a run on timer in it so the fan will energize when you flick the switch and then when you turn off the switch it'll run for either 30 minutes, 15 minutes or 5 minutes depending on how you put the settings. So we'll just take a closer look. Just pop it off there. You see there's the, the three connections that line up with. So what you'll do there is you'll wire this from a light switch, break it through a fan isolation switch outside the bathroom, it's part of the regulations, then take the switched live which comes from the light switch to this first, um, this first connection and you'll have your neutral in the middle which obviously allows it to work and then you'll have a permanent live. You want this coming out of the common side of your switch outside the bathroom. This will always be live no matter whether the fan's on or not and what it does is it allows the fan to, to have the, the power to run on for the extra 5 or 10 or 15 minutes just to clear the, uh, the bathroom of any moisture. This is the cable that you think you're going to be dealing with, 1.5 4 core cable. So it is, you'll have your, you'll have your live switched You'll have your you'll have your common, you'll have your neutral, you'll have your neutral there, sorry, and you'll have your earth there. What you want to do with these is you want to tape these up just to um, just to identify them a bit better when they're connected. That's how to connect a four-inch extractor fan in a bathroom.